What up, YouTube? Stevie Knight here. Night talk ish was cracking with the home team. Um, I don't know what I'm about to do, bro. I'm doing what y'all tell me to do. We up on the whatever podcast. One more again. When uh, Andrew Wilson in the building. Um, before we tap in, though, shop StevieKnight.com. You feel me for the drizzy up. Drizzy up. <laughs> Motherfucker said drizzy up. I'm old, dog. Don't nobody, don't nobody tell me no drizzy up no more. <laughs> yeah. Um, like the video, subscribe to the channel, man. And uh, what did she say? She think 80 million of men would victimize her if they had a chance. Oh, here we go. Here we go. What percentage of men do you think, in the circumstances provided, would choose to victimize you? Starting with you. Go ahead. What percentage of men? Right, because so if it were in the United States, uh, it's a random man. That's half the population. I don't know how much is that. One hundred sixty million men. Yeah. You're asking what percentage of them would choose to victimize right, because, well, me? So, so you so you picked the bear over mm -hmm. the man. So you must have done some sort of calculus where you feel that the risk. That's okay. You feel the risk is greater with a man compared to a bear. So you must have some sort of determination when it comes to. Uh, risk assessment. Mm -hmm. So if you had to assign a percentage, which men would choose to attack you, I guess? Which type of men? No, 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 no. What percentage okay. of men? All men, men would attack you. And I mean, like, I feel like that's kind of hard to answer. I'm just going to piggyback off of what she said, which is that bears are predictable. You okay. know that they're made. But I'm asking you a question. So this. I'm just getting answer to the, the answer. Okay, go ahead. Bears main like a bear we know their main goal is to kill us right whatever sure. they want to attack our face how you guys are saying yep. whatever talked about that yep men we don't know they have like a plethora of things they could do sure manipulation could be a part of it they could be like yeah. oh i'm gonna take you home don't even worry and then boom they kill it could, you it could be a. and so that's why i feel yeah. like it's a higher percentage mm. with men versus bears because we know what to do in the situation with a bear most people have been, I don't know if most people have, but I've been taught what to do in the situation with a bear. With men, I'm, am I not speaking into you're, it? You're like, you're okay. like over Is here. it like only in the center? You just, think like, the think of like, think I'm of, like actually so confused. Okay, think of the center of your mouth. The center of your mouth needs to be center with the microphone. Okay, so the sides don't count. I can't talk into the just sides. Center of okay, the microphone. Okay, gotcha, center. Um, yeah, there's a plethora of things okay. men can do. So can you answer the question, though? What percent? I, yeah. I Just guesstimate. I, I acknowledge, yes, a man could do all sorts of things. They so could I'm going to say things. a higher percentage. I don't fucking know the percentage, but I'm going to say it's higher. What, like 50, do you, 75? Do you, how about, do you think it's a majority of men? So more than 51%? Yes. Okay. Do you want to actually give us a, a range? You think it's 60? You think it's 70? You think I it's 80? I don't, I don't understand know. the fucking question. Let me run it back, dog. Did I miss something? 50% of what? What percentage of men do you think, in the circumstances provided, would choose to victimize you? Oh, y'all didn't provide no circumstances, though, so I don't even know what to do with this. Like, what are the circumstances? Being, lo being lost in the woods? I don't know what to do with this. A man could do all sorts of things. They so could I'm going to say things. a higher percentage. I don't fucking know the percentage, but I'm going to say it's higher. What, like 50, do you, 75? Do you, how about, do you think it's a majority of men? So more than 51%? Yes. Okay. Do you want to actually give us a, a range? Do you think it's 60? you think it's 70? you think I it's don't know. 80? I don't know. I just think it's, it's a, a lot of men. Okay. So do you want to actually just throw a percentage out there? <clears throat> no. Well, you you already said it's over fifty one, so just throw a percentage out. I just don't know the percentage. I just know it's like higher than half. More than half. Yeah. Per se, we could it's like fifty one percent. Sure, fifty one percent. Okay, you said bear, correct? Yes. What percentage of men do you think would attack you in these circumstances? Based on my life, based on my track record, ten percent. <laughs> Honestly, I agree. Again, from my personal record, I feel like I feel like fifty one percent. From my personal statistics, not from anyone else's. Your personal st statistics. Like from what's happened to me in my life, not anyone else's. Like. Okay, um, so you have a, like, do you have any siblings, male siblings? Uh, my brother. Mm -hmm. Father, Trans. uncles. Oh yeah, no, I have a stepdad and a dad, uncles. Okay, and like, all the men. So you're basically 
the men that you know in your life, 51% of them would victimize a woman in these circumstances? I wouldn't say the men in my life, but men... Like, so you're right. just a better judge of character than the general population? Or? Oh, no, 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 not at all. Like, again, okay. from my, like, and I'm not speaking for everyone else. Everyone has their own stuff. Like, I don't hate men. Like, I'm just saying from my personal life. I love my stepdad. So in your men. personal life, what's the percentage? I'd say 51%. And I'm not saying, like, my, No, of the men that you know in your personal life. Oh, that life, are right now? That you know, yeah. Right now, mm -hmm. none of them, because I don't, like, I, I don't need those people in my life if they're going to, like, victimize me and, like, do this bad shit to me. Like, there's no reason to have them in my life. So every man that's in my life right now is... They're cool. I don't have nothing but respect for them. She don't Including my course. father. Who my else dad. said bear? Did anybody over here say bear? No. Okay. So just to be clear, you guys think that 80 million men in the United States would choose to attack a woman in these circumstances? <laughs> just so I have that understanding correct. I think it's hard to put a number on this. How is it hard? I just think it really just like kind of depends i know if you put like a bunch of men and like say like a purge night where everything is legal do you think that 51 percent of men would like be like go like nuts or hell oh. no that's just i'm not entirely know. familiar with that movie i think i have a basically general... they kill and do, all the crimes Everything's are legal, legal basically all the no, crimes I yeah think, even i think in that movie it wasn't that even, high like murder and stuff like that so uh, if you put yeah like, oh bro of course the bitches are stupid they're ridiculous with their assessments, bro. But that's scary, just thinking about the dating climate. You know what I'm saying? It seems like the majority of these girls up here just said they think that the majority of men would attack them, given the chance, bro. That's scary, dog. That's scary, bro. They basing that shit off of bullshit. You gotta be a sick fuck, or a weak fuck, or a lost fuck to actually victimize, physically assault on women. Period. Given the circumstance, or you took take the circumstance, you have to be a sick fuck. That is not representative of men, generally. Those are representative of sick fucks, which means they think the majority of men are sick fucks. That's 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 terrifying, dog. As a man trying to go out here and find a woman, bro, you got that shit stacked up against you too, man. It's like, what the fuck happened in their goddamn life for them to feel so strongly about that? Not even strongly. I definitely don't even feel strongly, bro. But what the fuck happened in their life for them to feel that many men would victimize them given the circumstance? The only context it makes sense is because men are so soft right now in this whole incel movement and men building this resentment towards women. But even that's a minority of men, given how soft men are today, bro. Because that is an aggressive tactic and most men today don't, don't got that shit in them most of these little gen z or motherfuckers don't got it in them to fucking put hands on a woman to take some shit from them right so even looking at it from that aspect makes no fucking sense bro but yeah the main message the main horrific message that i get from this is bro i understand why motherfuckers is staying a hundred yards away from bitches bro i understand why keanu reeves don't even put his hands around bitches and shit bro because you gotta deal with shit like this so then what happens when you hear shit like this is, and it's already happened. It's already happened, bro. There's no chivalry no more. Women aren't protected no more for a number of reasons, dog. This just adds more fuel to the flame for another reason for men to stay their ass, to stay they asses away from women, bro. The irony in this is that their belief is entirely wrong. It's entirely wrong. But... What is true, what is more true is that the majority of these little Gen Z girls believe this shit. <laughs> Ain't that about a bitch. The majority of these girls out here today believe that most men will victimize them given the fucking chance. And that's a sad fucking day, dog. That's a sad fucking day, right? Especially they were, it literally makes no sense, bro, because men aren't aggressive. Men aren't expressing masculinity men aren't these toxic masculinity motherfuckers more men aren't doing this machismo shit no more men aren't massaging this bro that's a small group of men out here advocating for that side of men the majority of these little gen z boys that they focusing on are more pussy than they are they wouldn't even come close to their ass they're too scared to talk to their motherfucking asses but these motherfuckers think that the scared little punk motherfuckers is out here gonna try to rape them that's crazy as hell, bro.
Uh, yeah, even in the movie, it wasn't that high. Even at in the all. movie, not, not even that Even in many the purge, people. bro, it was a select few going crazy. And that's what would happen, bro, if total anarchy took place right now and there was a literal purge. The motherfuckers that would be purging are the crazy motherfuckers. Most people would get violent to defend themselves. People out here proactively trying to fuck people up, that's going to be a minority of people, men, man or woman, just like it would be in men. Most men will fuck them up 51%. Y'all motherfuckers is crazy. I wouldn't even know what to do with that, bro. Like, if I was single now and I was going out trying to mingle and shit, I'd be literally concerned about how bitches would move in regards to me, bro. Five years ago, I wasn't concerned about that shit. One bit, you literally got to go out here and be worried about a bitch's perception of you, regardless of how the fuck you or you're acting, right? Like, that shit would, I would have to, like, think twice about where the fuck we going and who the fuck we going to be around with. We're going to have to vet everybody to come around us. Like, if a woman come around me, I'm going to have to know somebody that she know, that she know, that she know to know that she a quality woman to fucking come out here interacting with, bro. Because ain't no fucking way I'm going to be out here trying to entertain some bitch that think half a man out here trying to put, 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 the, put the tip in aggressively. Bitch, are you crazy? The fuck? People participated in the purge. That that's an insane number. Well, that's a fantasy. That's, that's 50, that's she, was just, she was actually using that as you an think example. That Fifty-one percent so. of men would do that. Why wouldn't they just enslave all women then? I don't know. I mean, that's like that's they like going back to the movie, the midwife, or what's it called, the midwife or whatever. But like, that's that's not. Why the purge are we is, talking about movies? Movies are listen, not real I'm life. It was a hypothetical I was saying. No, I'm saying hypothetically, if you got a real life purge, like if everyone in this room, if we sorry, if we started a purge. I think that mm -hmm. 51% of men would like, I don't know. What percentage why? of women? You should ask them why. Why you think that way? Why? Because of social media? Why? Because you ran into half the men you've dealt with intimately put hands on you? That's why you're going to generalize a whole male species? Because the men you fucked with, did you like that, bro? It's just retarded. I'd say, I don't know. Maybe 1%? Like one percent of women, ninety-nine percent of women are good. Fifty at minimum, fifty-one percent of men. Oh, they would like bad. go after men. No, I'd say like I mean it's obviously going to be a large amount because like both genders obviously like have issues, but statistically more crimes are committed like by men, like according what to percentage yeah, what of percentage women. of men do you think are committing the crimes? <laughs> anyway, these little teeny bobbers don't know what they're talking about. Issues, but statistically more crimes are committed like by men. Like according what to percentage studies. of women in the purge situation? Yeah, a tiny, it's I mean that's true, but it's such a tiny. Do you, do you realize that the amount of violent crime perpetrated by men, as a whole per cap, it's still very very small. Most I mean, men is, are not out committing violent crime. Almost no man, in fact. Well, almost no man. But almost if you, what? no man. If yes, you think yes, that the repercussions correct. were almost taken no away, could you please repeat that? You're talking about a small percentage of society which ever commits violent crimes. Teeny tiny percentage. I mean. You're saying most of them small percentage. <laughs> are not men who are committing these crimes. No, no, no that's not what I said. Okay, would I they said not do it because of morals or the repercussions? Than women, it's still a small percentage of men overall who commit crimes. No, but are we speaking like, say, again, there's repercussions. Say the repercussions are taken away. Do you think that that would make more men act out? Are they The majority of men are not doing terrible things because of repercussions. Men are not doing terrible things because most men are not terrible people. It's crazy. That's crazy, bro. Yeah, like that because it's against their morals. Yeah, I think, or you, I think that more women would act out as well if you well, took the I mean, yeah, I'm not saying away, sure. I'm not saying that's wrong. I just think st statistically, according to all of that, like I, I don't want to mention certain topics on here, but more, and I'm not saying it doesn't happen with women, but statistically, more men do crimes like that. And I'm not saying like because I hate men or anything. Like it's, it's literally a, just a statistic. Yeah, I, like, but I mean, there's no yeah. disagreement that more men commit violent crimes than women nobody's disagreeing that that's true oh no i know it's the scale in which you believe it's right. true that we're yeah. questioning well what Let's was your beyond statement? probable cause that's 51 percent. your statement women could be like 49 percent was that yeah. yeah i'd be i'd be so fixated on the topic that i be forgetting who's talking like i'm literally giving like retards attention but regardless i still think they're belief system is reflective of most women that age today. I think that most women that are victim of social media and propaganda and brainwashing all think that men are the fucking devil. And I know that y'all that follow this channel, 
the women that do believe the opposite. But the women that follow this channel are the minority, especially the minority that actually voice shit. Right? But y'all let me know. The women follow this channel. Do y'all think the majority of women, these Gen Z women, I don't know, ages 18 to say 25 believe that most men will victimize them given the chance? Let me know. <laughs>